Welcome to the intro. I hope you enjoy the video. Hey guys, Demon here, doing another Steven Universe review. This time back to the kindergarten. This episode, um, compared to the last few in this Steven Bomb, fairly lackluster. Uh, but I do get some of it, and it's, it's actually a pretty nice episode. It's not horrible, uh, to say the least, it's not horrible. Uh, but compared to the rest of the Stephen Bomb, it's very lackluster. It seems like the first two episodes were the best, and then it's been kind of declining from there, but let's hope for the best. <laughs> but this episode was okay. It was, it was okay. Uh, it starts off with Stephen... Uh, and Steven is actually feeling a lot better now. From last episode, uh, last episode he was depressed as all hell. But now he's getting better. He's he's letting go more and he's just like, whatever will be will be. Like that song, you know? <laughs> uh, you know, when I was just a little girl. <laughs> uh, hey, Sarah, Sarah, I think it's called. Uh, whatever will be will be. That's the sign. It's, it's, it's a really good sign, actually. And Steven's starting to let go, and so he's not depressed. But Peridot is holy hell depressed. Um, she's more depressed than Steven ever was. Maybe because Lapis was more close to her? I don't think Lapis was more close to her than Connie was to Steven. Uh, but she lost her house and her best friend. So yeah, she's way depressed. And I saw a really funny moment in there, actually. Um, she was listening to depressing music. <laughs> that's, that's just funny, because that just reminds me of, like, just human beings in general. Like, when human beings are depressed, we listen to depressing music. At least I know a lot of people do. I mean, when I'm depressed sometimes, uh, when I was, like, depressed, like, real bad, I used to just, like, sit there and just listen to depressing music all the time. Just music to make me more depressed. I don't know why. It's just, like, this mindset you get into... It's just like, oh, this music knows my soul. It's, this is the only thing I have. Everything else sucks, but this music, it knows me. This music is just as depressed as I am. <laughs> I just say, it was, it was just this kind of funny uh, joke there. Maybe it wasn't a joke, but it was just funny to me. Uh, because, you know, if you ever feel depressed, uh, you know that sometimes you'll listen to this depressing music. It's, it's pretty hilarious. Um, but anyways, Lapis is super depressed. They go to kindergarten. They go to the kindergarten, I should say. And Amethyst is actually looking up at the kindergarten now because now she can put faces to where those places were before. Uh, she can put faces to where the... not Put, put faces to the holes that are there now because she met all the other Amethysts. Um, so we see all that, and that's pretty cool. And Peridot makes some jokes. <laughs> um, and by then they see a flower and they're like, this life is not supposed to grow here. And Peridot has a cool little thing there. Uh, Peridot has this cool little speech. Um, right back, actually. Uh, brief break. Hey guys, brief interruption to remind you, if you like my content, to subscribe and watch more videos. If you like this video in particular, leave a like, comment, and share it, if you will, and enjoy the rest of the video. But anyways, back to it. Peridot has this brief little cool speech where she's like, I used to think life began here. Like, this is where useless energy, like, this is where energy was made into something useful. Like, useless energy just flowing around, just have nothing to do. It was absorbed and made into a useful gem. It was made into something useful. But now that I've been on this earth and I've seen all these life, like all the plants and the animals and the bugs and like all the life around me, I realized that these kindergartens are things that destroy life. And man, that that really got me, man. That's 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 deep, man. She can realize that the kindergartens are not good that they destroy life instead of give life. Well, they give life, but they also destroy more life. So that's that's interesting, man. That's interesting. That she said that. It's interesting. 
In the end, though, uh, we see that there's a flower growing, growing, not glowing. <laughs> uh, so they're like, oh, maybe life can grow here again after thousands of years. Uh, but it turns out not to be true, because they try, it all dies. So, and it seems like they all, like, withered really quickly, so maybe it still kind of absorbs life. Huh. I wonder if that's why life can't grow there. Is something still absorbing life there, maybe? It seems like it, because those plants were healthy, but then also when they come back, they were all dead. Plants usually don't take that, like, a day to die like that, so... Maybe there's still something there that absorbs life. And maybe once you turn that thing off, life can grow again. I don't know. That's just an interesting thing to think about. But anyways, uh, this plant turns out to be a gem creature. A corrupted gem, I think. I don't think it's a... It's a shard gem. I think it's a corrupted gem. Paradox gets eaten by it, and they fight it. Steven and uh, Steven and Amethyst turn into <sighs> Smoky Quartz. I think that's her name. Its name is their name. <laughs> Smoky Quartz kick its butt, kick its ass, and then at the end, Lapis gets all upset. Not Lapis. <laughs> I mean. Paradox gets all upset and says nothing will ever change and like everything's just bullshit and everything's garbage and like what's there to do now and she just falls to the ground going like god damn I hate the world um, but then by the end we start seeing that Steven and them actually are getting to her and she's starting to feel more happy uh, because she's just like maybe maybe like I'm wrong maybe maybe stuff can she doesn't say that but like She's starting to think a little bit more happy because they're like, because she's like, thanks guys for bringing me with you, pretty much. Because, I know it's cheesy to say this, but no matter how much your life sucks, no matter how much it goes downhill, you, it can get better. I'm not saying it will get better, okay? I'm not one of those guys that are like always positive and saying, your life will always get better, because it might not, okay? There's, there's a good chance that won't. Uh, but if you try hard enough, and you gotta put some effort in, your life will and can get better. Uh, you just gotta try hard enough, you know, and you just gotta realize to let things go, you know. It's 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 a hard thing to do, but like you gotta do it, man, or else you're being that slump for years, and you might even kill yourself because it's crazy. I don't know, <laughs> but uh, I don't know, man. Life. If you try hard enough, you'll get through it. Um, but that's what Paradox starts realizing at the end there. So it's pretty cool. And uh, it's also pretty cool to see Shorty Squad back together. And the train was a reference to the first time she took Steven to the kindergarten. I think that's a reference to the first episode. I forgot what the episode's name is, but I think that's a reference to it. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, but Shorty Squad's back to the other again. <laughs> and Lap, I mean, Peridot, I keep on mixing up their names. Peridot is actually feeling a lot better. That's pretty cool. And as I said, if you work hard at it, life can get better. It not necessarily will, especially if you sit on your ass all day and do nothing. But if you work hard at it, life can get better. Can. <laughs> Interesting episode. Uh, but still lackluster compared to the other ones. Anyways, that's my review on this. Hope you liked it. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, my friends, stay sane. Peace. Hey, guys. Just remind you to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and watch more videos. Until next time. Say hi. Say hi. Hey, guys. Just hanging here with my, my nephew. Yeah, it's a phone. It's a phone, yeah. <laughs> you can't have it, right?